Hi ladies, I'm Michelle and welcome to your Kegels morning workout. Well, it's a lovely morning here and I thought we'd take the opportunity to go through a quick morning workout so that you've actually made a really good start to your day with your Kegel exercises. So let's get started at home wherever you are. We're doing this in sitting this morning. I'm on an exercise ball here, but you could just as easily do this on a chair. If you're on the chair, sit forward away from the back of the chair. So sit yourself nice and tall, lengthen through the crown of your spine, relax your shoulders back and down. Visualize your pelvic openings, the, the, pass, the three passages, the opening at the front, middle and back. And we're gonna start a lift and squeeze, a strong squeeze and lift. We're gonna be doing a combination of long exercises and short exercises throughout this little workout. So let's get started now with the first long exercise. So squeeze and lift through the back, middle and front passages. Go, squeeze and lift, holding one, two, keep lifting three, Four, keep lifting, five, six, strong as you can, seven, eight, relax down, let your pelvic floor muscles go, and we're gonna repeat another one straight away. Ready? And go strong, front, middle, and back passages, go strong, lift, squeeze, one, two, keep lifting, three, four, keep breathing, five, six, seven, eight, and relax down, relax through your pelvic floor, let everything relax back down to resting, take a nice deep breath in and out. Remember, it's not your buttock squeezing, it's not your tummy drawing in strongly, it's in and around your pelvic opening. Let's do two quick exercises now. Ready? Quick squeeze, lift and lower. Here we go. Strong squeeze, lift, go up and down inside. And again, squeezing and lifting up and relax down. So muscles inside, lifting and lowering down. All right, another two long ones. Ready? Set your posture, nice and tall. Go, strong. One, two, three, Four, keep going, five, you can do it, six, seven, eight, and relax down and rest. Next one coming up, take a deep breath in and out. Here we go, drawing up and in, closing off, squeezing, lifting, one, two, keep going, three, four, and five, six, high as you can, seven, keep lifting, eight, and relax down and rest. Here come our next two fast ones. Go strong, squeeze, lift and down and again strong squeeze lift and down and have a breather we're nearly halfway roll your shoulders up and around reset your posture thinking nice and tall if you like to you could actually lean forward if it gives you better sensation through the ball or through your pelvic floor you can lean forward maybe for the next two ready let's go strong lift and squeeze one two keep lifting three four you can do it five keep breathing six seven eight and relax down slowly if you can, if it's not already relaxed, and take a break. And don't worry if you're only doing a couple of seconds at a time, just do what you can do at home, that's fine. Let's go again, strong, go, one, two, inside, three, four, and five. Keep going, six, seven, eight, and rest, and relax it right down. Okay, big breath in and out. Two quick ones, here we go. Squeeze and lift, go and down, and again, strong squeeze and lift, up, inside, and down, and relax. We've got one more round to go, we're nearly there. So roll your shoulders up and around, reset through your posture. If you want to lean forward, you can. If you want to sit upright, I'm going to sit upright for my next set. This is the last set, ready? And go, strong, lift and squeeze, one, two, three. Come on, you can do it, four, keep breathing, five, six, keep lifting, seven, higher, eight, and relax down, have a breather. And next one, go, lift, one, two, three, four, and five, six, keep going, seven, eight, and rest, and relax down. We've got a couple of quick short ones to go. Let's just see if we can do four to finish off. Ready? And go, squeeze, and lift, one, and down, inside, two, strong as you can, brisk, and down, three, lift it, and down, and one more time, lift and squeeze, and down, and take a break. So that's it, that's all you need to do this morning. Ideally, if you're strength training, you can do that a couple more times during the day. So we've done our long holds, and we've basically we've been holding ours for about six, seven seconds. Ideally, you're trying to hold from between three to 10 seconds every hold you do. So you're doing your long holds, we've done eight repetitions, and trying to do eight to 10 of your really fast contractions every day as well. So I hope that it helps you with your pelvic floor strengthening at home. You can check out our playlist here, uh, just above here, if you'd like to um, get some more Kegel exercises. Uh, visit me at Pelvic Exercises. I look forward to exercising with you again soon. Bye for now.